This is Concepts, a power tool for sketching out and developing ideas. It's like pen and paper, but mixed with vector strokes, an infinite canvas, colors from Copic Marker, and powerful exports like CAD and SVG. This video goes over use of the Object Library, a brand new addition in Concepts 4.2 that brings beautiful, royalty-free vectors into your drawing for learning, planning, and straight-up productivity. The first thing you'll notice is a brand new option on the toolbar, the Objects menu. Tap, and you'll see the menu pop up. It'll be either on the side of the screen or at the bottom. If you're on iPad, you can switch it in Settings. On iPhone, it's always at the bottom. Then just scroll through with a swipe. Objects are super easy to use. Pull the object you want onto your drawing. A tap will also work and you can pull them in as fast as you like. Now, if you're familiar with our vector-based adjustment system, you'll already know what to do next. One finger drags, two finger scale and rotate, etc. We've added some new tricks we'll talk about in another video, which you can find in the notes below. These object packs automatically inherit the properties of your current brush. So if you switch between a pen and a pencil, or the marker or filled stroke tools, even different colors, your object palette will instantly adapt to that change. Of course, like anything else in Concepts, you can change them after the fact, but it can be faster to set them first. You can find more objects by tapping the More button at the bottom of the object menu. This is the object library. It's filled with hundreds of objects, all royalty-free and focused on making your job easier. Once you've found your pack, just tap to show the detail. The first few objects in every pack are free. Just tap the Sample button to use them. Anything with an orange dot is free. We are really excited about the power and convenience of objects and look forward, as always, to your feedback. Thanks for using Concepts and helping us build the future of design.